how with you know the moon's rough terrain uh, how how does it complicate the landing actually I yeah mean, Actually, uh, see what happens is uh, we require a plane surface for our lander to land uh, and uh, uh, then only uh, it will not topple uh, the lander after landing it will not topple if uh, it is not uh, you know if it is a plane surface but what has happened is on the uh, south side of the moon uh, there are so many craters right that is one thing and second thing is there are so many ups and downs that means it is a rugged terrain and uh, we had to make sure that we don't get into the problem in uh, not i mean in landing on a uh, some kind of uh, you know uh, elevated area and you know one leg on the top and one leg on the bottom it will definitely topple and the further operations will, will be in jeopardy because we have to get the rover out of it then the rover has to uh, travel on the moon surface and it has to do many functions so all those functions will be jeopardized if the lander does not land on a fairly plain surface and that is why it is difficult but we have taken enough precautions we have got identified an area which is large enough 4 kilometers by 2 and 1/2 kilometers is a large area which we have identified by means of chandrayaan 2 orbiter and uh, the, in addition to that we have also identified two specific spots which are very favorable for landing uh, by means of Ch chandrayaan 2 orbiter which is still doing its job there and uh, we are sure that we will not get into any of these problems after landing 